Welcome to our Shiva. We are here with Isabella and Bella. We're, today we're going to be interviewing teachers and asking them questions. My name is Mrs. Knoll and I am a sixth grade teacher at Florence Marcoffer Elementary. I became a teacher because I was always really good with children growing up. I pretty much was everyone's babysitter and I just really enjoyed kids. And when I went to college, I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to do, but my high school teacher asked me if I would tutor their grandson in reading. And so I did. And I just, there was something so neat about watching him go from struggling to read to feeling confident and excited. And um, I just, I really loved seeing that. And I, from that point, knew exactly what I wanted to do. And I have not regretted it a day in my life. Teaching has been amazing. Um, at Mark Offer, I also do MM News. I started the program here five years ago. And it's been really neat to see the kids take on a profession of videography so seriously and edit and run the entire studio. I literally do nothing. I show them how to use the equipment and then they take it to a completely different level and they've just been so amazing. I don't know what else was to say. Mr. Carl, I'm the computer teacher here at Florence Markoffer. I've been doing this for about 10 years now. Uh, I chose this job because I like school. I spent a lot of years in school. I should be a lot smarter. And also because I like being around kids all day. So this is a perfect job for me. Hi, I'm Miss Jessica here in the library. I am the library media specialist here at Mark Offer and I started working here seven years ago because I just love the kids so much. I'm Mr. Zender. I'm the PE teacher here at Mark Offer Elementary. Uh, I also teach second grade on Fridays. Uh, this is my 15th year of teaching, uh, which is crazy. I'm 37 years old. Um, and uh, I became a teacher because uh, I've, I've just always uh, loved working with kids. Um, uh, and uh, I'm a basketball coach as well. I've been coaching basketball for uh, many years. I started at the high school level, and now I coach our fifth and sixth grade uh, boys team. Uh, I also became the coordinator for the entire district. So uh, it's been it's been a big job, but um, I love working with athletes, and uh, it's the best job in the world. All right. So uh, my name is Ms. Parker. I teach fifth grade, and I would say that I became a teacher um, because I wanted to make a difference. Um, growing up, I had a lot of really great teachers who pushed me and encouraged me to always do my best. And I really want to give back to the world and I want to show other students um, that they can do the same. So I would say that I became a teacher because it's important because those are the, you know, the very first encouragers we have in life. And I would like to add myself to that list of encouragers. Good job. Good morning. My name is Mrs. Cooper. I am a retired educator. I am a privileged I have the opportunity to come back and be of service to the Mark Offer students. I love having this chance to come back and help and see my family because Mark Offer is my home away from home. Hi, Mark Offer. My name is Rhonda Moitoso. Um, I have been teaching at Mark Offer for 15 years. It's my 30th year of teaching, and I teach first grade at Mark Offer, all 15 years in first grade. And I got into teaching because um, prior to teaching, I was doing social work, and I realized I wanted to help children um, before they became in a crisis situation. Um, and first grade is where you learn how to read, and if you can read, you can do anything. Miss Julie, I'm a yard supervisor at Mark Offer. Um, I think that I took this job because after being a stay-at-home mom for 18 years, it was just time to get back into the workforce. And now with teacher shortage and everything going on with COVID, I really took the opportunity to just be here for kids and 
It's really rewarding every single day. And I'm learning from you guys every single day. Things are changing in our society. And I'm just here for you guys. Make sure you're safe. Make sure you're doing what you're supposed to be doing. And I'm learning from you also. So thanks for having me.